<sighs> now! <sighs> Phew, that was a close one. What are you saying? That was exhilarating! I see. Good to hear. But I have to admit that I didn't expect myself, the Demon King, to be saved by you. I don't really remember what I did. But all that came to mind was that I couldn't let you go. I did bring you to where we were. And I do want you to see more than what you saw down there. Hm. I see. Jack, without you, I would not have been here. Well, not in a physical sense. I mean that I wouldn't have been alive like this. Come on, you're exaggerating. I'm not exaggerating. <clears throat> exaggerating. Huh? Thanks to you, I have friends now. Precious friends. I spent my whole life alone, and I now know what it's like to have friends I care about. Hamlin. I'm sure I was quite peculiar to you when we first met. <laughs> You're a great and wonderful demon king, Hamlin. Oh, uh, of course! Shoot! Hey! Are you two alright? Jack! Hamlin! Everyone! It seems as if everyone is safe. Yeah, I'm so glad they're safe. Hm. I extend my thanks to you once more, Jack. Huh? Why? Thank you for grabbing my hand during my fall. I didn't know the joy of having one's hand grabbed. You've got it slightly wrong there. Hands aren't meant to be grabbed. They're meant to be held. Ah, uh, I see. Another lesson learned. I'm grateful to have met everyone, especially you. Hamlin, the jail story ended. But our story, our new story is about to begin. Our story, a story that will see everyone together forever. Yep, we can finally go home. Well then, the new story will begin with the party where you and I will be together. <sighs> Ooh, looks like we're okay. Yes. That was close. I knew it was a risk, but... Uh, what? Jack! Are you alright? You look sick! I'm sorry. I'm okay now, Cinderella. I was just tripping over myself. <laughs> Don't hit me! You... You really are stupid! Cinderella? I wasn't worth enough to have you risking your life like that! That's not true! J Jack? You're much more important than you think! I wanted to save you! I wanted to save you for who you are, Cinderella. I want you to live. So please, don't say anything like that again. You're a very precious person to me, and everyone else. You keep teaching me things, Jack. You keep telling me that I'm fine. And with a smile. Caring for myself? means the same thing as treating everyone around me with care. Cinderella, you teach me a lot too. What it means to be truly strong and kind. I'm still grateful for the time you tore your dress to treat my wounds. <laughs> oh, um, that isn't so big of a deal. Well, one day, I want to wear a beautiful dress again for you to lay your eyes on. I wouldn't mind seeing that. And... Jack! Cinderella! Hey, you two! Are you alright? Everyone! It looks like everyone escaped safely. Yeah, what a relief. The story here has ended. But it seems we're not alone. Indeed. I will always be here. I'm sure you will, Cinderella. <laughs> well said. The jail story ended. But our story... Our new story is about to begin. I'm sure the new story will be filled with beautiful, happy tears. And... 
you will be with us too. We made it. I guess we got out of this alive. In any case, I need to ask you to not do such a risky thing like that again. Haguya. Even if I were saved, if you died, it would have all been for nothing. What would I have done if you died? You're right. I'm sorry. But I really wanted to save you. What? The moment that crossed my mind, I had already jumped and you were in my arms. I'm just happy you're safe. <sighs> I'm tired of getting angry already. So I'll just let you go this time. Thanks, Kaguya. <sighs> I can't believe how emotional I am now. How times have changed. I suppose change is what I really wanted. In fact, I have changed quite a bit from before. You've changed? You already know how afraid of humans I was. No, more like how I hated humans. I still can't say for certain that I like them. But this last battle, and telling the followers what was on my mind, lessened my fear. And I feel like I can look forward now with friends like you. I owe it all to you, Jack. Same here. You kept everything inside and stayed lazy. So I was able to try my hardest and... Wait a sec. That doesn't sound like I appreciated what you did. That's fine. I don't plan on changing my lazy ways. Which of course means I'll need a servant. Huh? What do you mean by that? Jack! Kaguya! Hey, you two! Are you okay? Everyone! It looks like everyone made it. Yeah, I'm glad we all made it. Jack, I suppose my story ends without me leaving where I am now. That must mean we can all be together again. Yes, of course. And... And? The jail story ended. But our story... Our new story is about to begin. The old story met a different ending. Leading to a new story for us to tell. Jack, thank you for letting me stay a part of this world. Whew! We somehow made it! <sighs> Sleeping Beauty, thank goodness you're safe. I am fine, but not you, Jack. Huh? You did too much, so... Thanks for worrying about me, but I'm okay. You're hurt all over, bleeding. Treat yourself better. Thanks. But I'm really okay. Sure, it was risky, but what better time than that to do my very best? <laughs> With you at stake, there's no way I could have let you go. by surprise. That was the most insane thing I've ever seen you do. Everyone! <laughs> oh, uh, are you sure you're okay? Are you feeling sleepy? It's okay. I'm not sleepy anymore. The curse wore off. I see. So that means your story ended. Yep. Now I can see my Prince. What? Prince? Prince? No. Jack is my precious friend. Oh, I see. You're my precious friend too. Yep. Sleeping Beauty? Hmm? The jail story ended. But our story, our new story is about to begin. Yep. Everyone's story. It should be fine now, Gretel. Thank you. <laughs> Looks like we're finally grounded. <laughs> Indeed. In more ways than one. I'm just glad you're safe, Gretel. I'm quite surprised you would risk your life to save me. You must have developed an acquired taste. Oh, uh... Acquired taste. Right. Why, yes. 
When I fell, you leaped at just the right angle to catch me in mid-air. I'm impressed you thought to use the Mary gun like that. If only I could have recorded it all. Wow. You're so calm that it's scaring me. I'm just kidding. In all honesty, I wasn't in the right mindset to think of any of that. How unusual. I'm here now with a sense of relief that I'm alive. After Hansel's departure, my only goal in life was to observe everyone. And I didn't care much about my own well-being. Gretel. <laughs> I wonder whose fault this is. Huh? Why are you looking at me? Hmm. If you don't know, that's fine too. I think I was able to fight because of you, Gretel. You taught me the importance of keeping my emotions in check. To calmly make the right decisions. Calmly, huh? Well, it doesn't seem like that, considering how quickly you moved to action when I fell. Uh, well, I just acted on impulse, and... <laughs> I'm actually appreciative of what you've done. Thank you, Jack. Thanks to you, I'm still here, alive. If you were off by even a fraction of a second, we would have accelerated straight downward. Jack! Gretel! Thank goodness you're alive! Everyone! Looks like everyone made it, too. Jack. What is it? I have no intention of dying ahead of you. What do you mean by that? I haven't researched you enough. Uh, I'm still your research subject? <laughs> Not quite. Not still. More like... forever. <laughs> but, Gretel... What? The jail story ended. But our story... Our new story is about to begin. I suppose it's not like me to say this, but... Yes, you're right. We've finally escaped from the Dark Forest, and everyone has made it back home. That also marks the beginning of a new story. Punzel, did it hurt? Maybe I squeezed you too hard. You okay, Jack? Huh? Me? Jack saved Rapunzel! <sighs> Thanks for saving me, Jack. I wanted to, Rapunzel. How come? I would be sad if you died, Rapunzel. Rapunzel's sad if you died too, Jack. I like Jack, so I want you with me. Rapunzel. Rapunzel's gonna be an adult. Rappy! Jack! Everyone! Jack! What is it, Rapunzel? Yay! Whoa! That's dangerous jumping on me like that. Rapunzel. What's gonna happen when the story's done, Jack? Well, the jail story ended. But our story, our new story is about to begin. New? Story? Yep, our story. Okay, Rapunzel's gonna be with Jack forever. That's right. We'll be together. And you can grow up to become an adult, just like everyone else. We made it! Ugh, I thought I was gonna die just now. Looks like you saved me again, Jack. But of all the things you could have done... I'm sorry, but that was the best I could come up with. I'm glad it worked. Looks like you're the one saving me all the time. Now that I think about it... I think I was able to bear Dad's betrayal because of you, Jack. If I'd been alone, I probably wouldn't have made it out with everything that's happened. Red Riding Hood. Thinking about Dad still feels weird to me. He killed everyone who found me. Then he cared for me. I loved him with all I had. I can't forgive him, but I can't not love him. It's all a jumble. I can't just hate him. That's very much like you, Red Riding Hood. 
learned how wonderful it is to care about your friends, how to care for others, from you. Jack, I wasn't doing anything special. I learned what I needed to protect those special to me. I learned strength, kindness, and pain. That's why I want you to at least share that burden, and not try to hide it behind a strong front. I want you to be who you really are, Red Riding Hood. Thank you, Jack. Jack, I want you to take better care of yourself. You do the darndest things when the pressure's on, and that hurts my heart. Red Riding Hood, I'm sorry if I worried you. Well, next time, let me know. Discuss with me what you want to do first. I want you to talk to me more than before. I am older than you, after all. Uh, but you seem to know what I'm thinking before I even say anything. Huh? Fine. I'll be sure to rely on you more, Red Riding Hood. Very good. Well then, let's do a lot more together, okay? Hey! Sister Red! Everyone! What a relief. Everyone's safe! We've got a lot to do now. Guess I need to get back in shape and do more sisterly stuff. Red Riding Hood. The jail story ended. But our story... Our new story is about to begin. You said it. We're going to help each other out, just like before. After all, we're a family now. That was close. Are you okay, Snow White? Yes, I'm okay. Thank goodness. But look at you. You're bleeding. Oh, um... It's okay. I just feel a bit dizzy, that's all. It's not okay! Huh? Bleeding can lead to other problems. Please, take better care of yourself. Snow White. Thank you. Snow White is the one who should be thanking you. Huh? You risked yourself like this. Just to save Snow White. And it's all thanks to you. Huh? You always supported everyone, which made us want to do better. I think that's why we all made it. Snow White didn't do anything. But I did learn that this was Snow White's role. Role? I always thought to myself that Snow White was a plain and ordinary girl. You believed in me, and that gave me the courage and the strength to talk about the traitor before. Snow White. Even if Snow White doesn't stand out, she wants to do what only she can do to make everyone happy. Snow White is happy just doing that. You're not plain at all, Snow White. In fact, you're... Jack! Snow White! Snow White! Hey! Everyone made it! Thank goodness! They're all safe! Yeah, guess we all made it. Um, Jack? If I feel afraid, or feel uneasy, will you be by my side? I'd have to ask the same to you, too. Though in my case, I might just worry you more. Um, Snow White? What is it, Jack? The jail story ended. But our story, our new story is about to begin. That's right. It's time to begin a new story with everyone in it. We made it? I, I'm still alive? Thumbelina! Thank goodness you're safe! I, I guess... So... We're finally done! Yeah... Wait a sec... Jack! I, yes? That was way too risky! I can't believe you used your Mary gun like that! I, I'm sorry... But... That was about all I could do... Well, well, well maybe, but... Uh... In any case, you had me worried there. Stupid. Thumbelina. But, um, thanks. I, I really appreciate what you did. I'm just glad you're safe. I'm glad that you're safe, too. It isn't like me to be like this. I can't seem to keep it together when you're around, you know? That isn't true. I think you're no different now than usual, Thumbelina. Y you think so? You've supported me all this time. I know you cared about me, too. <laughs> now 
Now I remember. Back when we first met, you mistook me for the youngest sister. <laughs> I'm sorry about that. But it dawned on me afterward how dependable you really are. Well, um, I think you helped me a lot too. You know, just like what happened here. Thumbelina. So, um, I know this story ended, but I want you to be with me for... Huh? Hey! Jack! Thumby! Sister Thumbelina! Hey! Everyone! Over here! Looks like everyone made it. Uh, sorry. What was it you were saying, Thumbelina? I want us to stay friends, got that? What adult. Oh, um, okay, sure. We'll always be together. What? Hm. Well, I guess if that's what you want, then. Um, uh, thanks, Jack. Thumbelina? What now? The jail story ended. But our story, our new story is about to begin. <laughs> You're right. It's time for us to get writing!